honorable uh, uh, principal of uh, your institute uh, all the respected professors faculties who are participating faculties of uh, your government uh, polytechnic nanded and uh, all the faculties who are uh, participating in this fdp uh, i'm i'm whatever i am today i'm speaking just before you as an invited guest is just because of my teachers and uh, i know what teachers can what role teachers can play in the life of right. students so uh, i have got a tremendous respect and i am very glad to see you all uh, actually i am a, i am a, i am a believer uh, that uh, this era of knowledge the greatest weapon in the era of knowledge is not atomic bomb not political power not economic power not religious power but in the era of knowledge which is the most powerful weapon is knowledge and nobody in this world not president of america or the prime minister of india can give this weapon or provide this weapon to the people or to the students only teachers have got this power they are empowered to give this weapon to provide this weapon weapon of knowledge where the students even a very uh, ordinary uh, a student from a very poor family can rule this world with this weapon of knowledge is uh, they can be that weapon can be provided by teachers and so i respect you all uh, all professors i will start my session with a very uh, interesting a very small uh, share uh, that is a urdu share uh, ye muskurate chehre mere tasbeeh ke dane ye muskurate chehre mere tasbeeh means jabmal ap ji jabmal kar do tera tasbeeh mantad urdu mein ye muskurate chehre mere tasbeeh ke dane hain inhe dekhta hu to ibadat ho hi jati hai thank you very much all of you we are today very interesting subject is given to me uh, and, and it is very i mean i will take you uh, to the journey of journey of amusman and that is disruptive innovations in in, in respect uh, with respect to industry 4.0 my friends have you heard about I mean, you must have heard about you have seen so many times about the pocket transistor but uh, you know when the pocket transistor was uh, first uh, invented when pocket transistor was invented you know the pocket transistor was invented first in 1990 1955 in 1955 before my birth it was introduced when pocket transistor was introduced first it was a craze in america in 1990 1955 it was it was a craze all the youngsters of america they used to have pockets a uh, transistor and jazz was a craze so they used to dance on jazz uh, using the those, those pocket transistor so now you will be amused or shocked to know can you imagine what was the price of that pocket transistor at that time in 1955 it was costing 3.5 lakhs sare 3 lakh ka to pocket transistor hai that time even today also if a big businessman or industry tycoon if we say we if we request if we, any his son or daughter request him to buy a pocket transistor costing 3.5 lakhs for him or her he will refuse he will he won't buy it for it for them so see a pocket transistor which was costing 3.5 lakhs sorry 3 lakh that time in 1955 how much it is costing today even a very rich person could not buy a pocket transistor that time now that pocket transistor that pocket transistor you know is costing only 40 to 50 rupees even a man even a boy a guraki from our area 
in that, that he is having that pocket transistor and he listens uh, on that pocket stand or pocket transistor various marathi songs hindi songs or the cricket comment they are fond of uh, listening to the cricket commentary on that pocket transistor which is costing 40 to 50 rupees uh, mostly 100 rupees at the most 100 rupees so this is how the innovation or the technology this media with the gari tantradhyana I have coined a word for this. This is the Vyattekari Tatradha. How the technology disrupts everything and see how, I mean, it, how it makes it makes the things ever affordable for you. Kiti swastha thale. I mean, uh, pocket transistor now costs only 40 to 50 rupees or at hardly 100 rupees. It, it was costing 3. Point lakhs, 3.5 lakhs rupees once upon a time when it was invented. It, it was invented by Sony. Even the sound of that particular that time pocket transistor was not as good as what it is today, which is which is costing only 1400 rupees. This is how the technological disruptions happen. You can you imagine now you can imagine, you know, the uh, Professor Clayton Christine Christensen, Professor Clayton Christensen from Harvard University. He was the man who coined in 1995, he coined the word disruptive innovations. And this was by it by, I mean, hailed by all the people that this is the best industry business idea of that century. This particular word, the disruptive innovation was taken or by it as the best business idea of that century. This is how you can imagine how the innovations and disruptions occur in our day-to-day -day life. From radio to today's, I mean, you, you are not seen the radios of that time when I was very young, very small boy. That time the radios, radios were totally different what you are seeing today. This is how, because we are all technocrats, we have to see how we have changed the world. How we have in, introduced uh, various things to this world and changed the face of this world. Have you heard about telephone? Now telephone was, you won't imagine telephone was once upon a time, it was a Symbol of status. Telephone, I'm talking about the landline state. It is now Atahapantala Adagadisha Guru Bhati Fekundele telephone. But once upon a time, it was a symbol of status. Even Narayan Murthy, you, you might have heard about everybody. I mean, all the, even the layman, even the man who is not a learned person. We are the technocrats. We know Narayan Murthy. We know Nandan Nilakeni. Nandan Nilakeni was my batchmate. When I was in IIT Bombay, I was in a, a different branch and he was in he was in hostel four and I was in hostel three. Nandan Nilkini was from my batch. Even Manoharji Parikar was one year senior to me in my department. The late, great Manohar Parikarji, our chief minister of Goa, a great man. So Nandan Nilkini and Narayan Murthy, these names are, I mean, Nandan Nilkini is a person of Aadhaar card. Aadhaar, this Aadhaar card's Kalpana, the idea was introduced by Nandan Nilkini, and he, he was a man who, uh, um, who introduced Aadhaar card to uh, us, everybody. So Nandan Nilkini, Narayan Murthy, they were not having a telephone. When they were, they were, they were thinking to start Infosys, that time they uh, have to talk uh, with a, they were having a tie-up uh, or a, a MOU, they have to sign an MOU with an American company. They came and stayed uh, in a Bangalore's five-star hotel. So these guys, they went to those people on a scooter, on a uh, Labrador scooter. So see how, and they were not having their own telephone. And telephone, having a landline telephone was, or any type of telephone was a compulsory uh, requirement for signing the MOU. So they uh, had, they had a letter uh, of consent from their uh, neighbor that this is a this telephone number i'm allowing these guys to use uh, for their business and then they were narayan murthy i'm talking about the imposes giants and imported tycoons narayan murthy nandan nilakari they were not having once upon a time telephone even when i was a secretary of lions club of Aurangabad, chikaltana in uh, i think uh, 1993 i was not having telephone landline telephone in my house in 93 and telephone was a compulsory thing so, uh, Rajendri Dalda, uh, he requested uh, that time's uh, uh, Lok, Lok, Lok Sabha parliament speaker 
Honorable P. A. Samba, and he gave his extra telephone number to me. So my telephone number is given by uh, Honorable uh, late P. A. Samba, sir. And see, those were the things that time telephone was so. I mean, in the taluka places, uh, only for, for 10, 15, 20 people used to have telephones. Now, a bhajiwali, kambali, by everybody is having, everybody, oh, everybody is having telephone, even a smart telephone with them. Boy, this is how that, this is how the disruption, this is how technology disrupts everything and it makes the things available for very uh, ordinary person, very poor person also. This is, this is a, then I put technologies are. This is how, this is a miracle of a technology the technological innovations. And you have heard about the cars also. You know how in four, five, and five, four, five to six decades before, 50, 60 years before, uh, when cars or in four wheelers used to enter the villages, all the boys, young boys used to run behind that uh, moving four wheeler just because of amusement that what is this? This is moving a four wheeler. Even the elderly people used to go and touch the car or the four wheeler. That, that was a time. Only Fiat and Ambassador were available in the market. Now you know all the smart cars are available. I mean, you can have, a, I mean, even, even you can have a customized, if you have money in your pocket, you can have a customized car. You are, you are talking, we are talking about the smart cars today. You, are, you can have a different type of all cars available in the market on the road or Indian road. Even a man who is not, not having, he is, uh, even a person who is uh, staying in a rented house, is, he owns his own car. So this is how technology makes the things happen. This, this is how technology interrupts and, and make the things available for the ordinary person. No, we are talking about the Tesla car. You must, you must have heard, even I have seen uh, when I visited America, my elder daughter is working in Microsoft. So whenever I go there, I have seen uh, the Tesla on, even my daughter is having Tesla. So the automation, the, I mean, uh, and the automatic cars, I mean, I'm not talking about the uh, automatic cars, I'm talking about the cars with all, all, all um, automation. So this is how uh, uh, Tesla is having only 12 moving parts. You might have heard about that. The car is coming in the market, which is having only 12 moving parts. You know, mechanical engineers must be here. Uh, they know that how much uh, moving parts are in uh, a car, in an IC engine car. There are around 10,000 moving parts in an in a, in a, in a, uh, IC engine car, in our, our cars. The Tesla is having only 12 moving parts. Even you can put your luggage in the bonnet. You can open the bonnet where the engine is there and put your luggage. This is how the notion. Only 12 parts, no maintenance. You don't have any, uh, you, have to, you don't have to care about the coolants and uh, other things and maintenance and wear and tear of, of so many parts. So you can imagine how the technology is taking us. We are talking about the autonomous cars. Even my daughter, when she went for the interview of Microsoft, she has uh, she, she was taken from the airport to uh, the headquarters in autonomous car, car without driver. Yes, I'm, I'm not talking um, about um, uh, me, I'm not telling you very, very tell. I'm talking about the facts I have seen in America. We have experienced, this is how the time is moving. This is how uh, the, 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 the innovation is taking us. These are, uh, the, this is how the things are taking. You must have heard about the company. I mean, see the disruptions. A, a man, I mean, how many cars were having? Even, even when I'm, I'm from a washroom, there were only four to five cars. We were having villages. Even the government officer used to ask, her, ask us, uh, my father, request my father to give his uh, four-wheeler for some important uh, work. So this is how now anybody can go to the showroom, pay first EMI and have his own car. This is technological, this is disruptive innovation happening in a life. We cannot imagine this is amazing things. This is different things we are 
facing just because of we engineers we have given we are giving uh, this this all thing to the world my friends you must have i mean we are all using i'm talking to you on this platform on this online platform but four or five decades before when i was a student of iit that time purchasing a computer was a big big thing it was costing around 1 bhk i mean around 70 lakhs 80 lakhs today 70 lakhs 80 lakhs i am talking about I mean, cost of 1 bhk it was uh, costing cost of 1 bhk that time purchasing computer was possible for big business houses big industry people or big, big institutions like iit even small institutions were not having they were not in position to buy by the computers now now what is happening now you see the computer is costing a quintal tandara cha changla basmati tandara cha pota evde kimmat computer cha it is costing a quintal of a basmati rice evdi sopi evde anybody can even your 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 uh, smartphone is what it is a, it is a far far better computer than what computers they were using that time we were using in iit not to be we have to go to bark for some important things for some fast i mean even our computers in iit were not uh, that much reliable so we have to go weekly to baba atomic research center to use uh, some uh, some computers there and we were not allowed directly to use computers only computer students were allowed to go for that so you can imagine the disruptive innovation me sir tumhala if i say you uh, that you are having in your pocket, you you know uh, you are having in your pocket a camera, a flash gun, uh, uh, so many cars, different type of car, and in your pocket. If I say that you are having a bank in your uh, pocket, if you say that you are having an uh, ATM in your pocket, if I say that you are having uh, a, 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 a mall in your pocket, then you will laugh at me and say that this man and Professor Dilip God is mentally gone. He is a mentally retarded, retarded person. But not my, not, 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 not my dear friend. I have, I don't have to convince you because you are technical people. You know that your smartphone is having all this thing. You can just imagine the time you are saving. You, are, you can just imagine the money you are saving. You can just imagine the things you have to carry. I mean, when we are, we are going from one place to another place, if I am living in India and going to America, how many things I have to carry if I have to do the professional work had all these things not been there in our life. Your smartphone in your pocket is having everything you have. It is a bank, it is a mall, uh, it is a, I mean, you can book any uh, car uh, with Ola app. It is having everything, your pocket, uh, in your pocket, your smartphone is carries everything you can just imagine on this earth. This is how, I mean, these smartphones are available, can be purchased in even four or five thousand rupees also. So, the cost of buying a quintal of rice, you can buy the best type of smartest computer possible. Even my this watch, it gives me all, this is a smart watch I'm having. This is an Apple watch. You know, this, 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 this is monitoring everything. If everything goes wrong in my body, it will immediately alarm and say me that stop talking. Your, uh, your BP is raising. Your pulse rate is becoming higher. So my friends, I want to just say that how the technological Innovations are changing our life and making us, uh, making our life very, very uh, easy. Even this, even in uh, um, when the disruption caused this, uh, I mean, pandemic disruption. This is the, um, I mean, I mean, all in every sector of the life, disruption is accelerated just because of, it is just because of the pandemic. Pandemic also accelerated uh, the disruption. But I'm talking about the naturally or technologically, uh, they, I mean, Gati uh, I mean, when, when we are living with a, a, a dynamic world, 
then disruptions are going to occur. I mean, you might, you have heard, I'm, ju I'm just taking you to that era of our, I mean, villages. I don't know how many people are from villages uh, and of that time's villages. When I was a kid, the, those villages were sus self-sustaining villages. I mean, they, those villages, uh, they uh, never have to depend on uh, other cities or big cities for their uh, livelihood. So they were self-sustaining. There are barbalute darashi system, tabri asaichi barter system, where all the carpenter, goldsmith, blacksmith, I mean, even the farmer, uh, even the, I mean, all almost all the people were living in the villages and they were all, all the artisans were living, I mean, in the villages. Uh, the potter, all, they were living in the village, in the village and the system was, their economy was running on the barter system. But that was disrupted by the, uh, by the industrial revolution. The first industrial industry revolution came and that was disrupted. Now, we don't have that type of life in villages now. So, you know, when we are talking about almost all uh, the speakers, the great speakers before me, they might have told you about all the industrial revolution and what is this industry 4.0. We all know as professors of uh, various technical institutions that Industry 4.0 is nothing, but it is driven by AI, artificial intelligence. Industry, uh, first industrial revolution is in, uh, was, it was driven by steam. At that time, steam was energy, and it was driven by uh, steam energy. First, then came the electrical energy and, and the speed of, uh, because of electrical energy, speed of, Second industrial revolution was tremendous. Then, after four, four or five uh, decades, came computers. Uh, two, two decades before uh, 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 this uh, uh, information and technology, IT came into our life. IT came into our life, and the chains are moving with a tremendous way. So, first industrial revolution was uh, driven by the steam energy, second was driven by uh, electric energy, uh, the fossil fuel, and third was driven by computer and uh, information technology. And this fourth industry revolution is driven by, this is driven by artificial intelligence. You, uh, or you all know, uh, almost all the technical persons know that what is artificial intelligence and how it is changing. It, 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 it is, I mean, even at AI is, uh, developing itself in exposure, exponential spread. We are engineers. We know the, the, what is different be, uh, between linear speed and exponential speed. And when we uh, have to uh, walk 30 steps, or uh, then by, with a linear step, I mean, we, will, we will travel at the most 30 meters. But with the exponential speed, if we want to uh, travel, 30 states, you know, it is as good as traveling 40,000 kilometers. 40,000 kilometers, which is the protection of the mother planet, going around the mother planet, around the mother, mother planet, it is 40,000 kilometers, my friends. So you can just imagine the speed with which we are moving. Tremendous speed. This AI has disrupting everything in his life in, a, I mean, this industry for, and that is uh, industry 4.0 is driven by AI. In a very simple term, I was uh, taken to uh, two years back uh, to Germany by GIJ, government of Germany and uh, government of India. I was invited uh, on that delegation to, uh, and had, we had a tour uh, of uh, Germany just to study the industry 4.0. When I visited Germany, I was amused of their, I mean, various companies we have seen, very simple and very nicely they, have, they were doing. I mean, how industry, how industry 4.0 is, how AI is uh, governing or controlling the industry 4.0, you know, you must be knowing, you must have heard about the literature. But in a very simple term, I will say that if we go to a pharmaceutical company and if a pharmaceutical company which is running uh, by 4.0, it what is that, that somebody is talking, so kindly note it. So, if, if the pharmaceutical company is uh, moving 
if a pharmaceutical is has to manufacture is is going to manufacture a can uh, cough syrup they are manufacturing a cough syrup that cough syrup will decide that bottle of cough syrup will decide the color of that bottle the size and shape of that bottle the uh, color of the uh, the liquid in that bottle the composition of chemical composition of uh, that everything the shape and size and color of the lead everything the label and what should be written on the label that will be decided by the end product and that is what is industry 4.0 but when I came and when, when I invite, when I was invited as a chief guest to talk before the Bharat Forge people in Baramati, I was shocked to say that such a huge uh, forging plant it was the I mean, rather, rather it is the first industry 4.0 plant in Asia. We are having, but I was I, mean, I was shocked to see the things in Germany, but I was more shocked to see that we are having in India the industry 4.0. Uh, you can visit, you can arrange to visit that Bharat Forge plant in Paramati and see that it is totally done. I mean, every, if something goes wrong in, forgery, in uh, forging, then uh, that um, uh, robo will uh, immediately inform uh, the controlling, uh, uh, controlling robo that I'm uh, having some difficulty in doing this particular uh, work. If that uh, controlling robo will analyze what, are, what is his problem and immediately he will send somebody, some other robo to solve his problem. His problem will be solved and the function will go. This is how, this is how amazing the things are having changing in the industry full auto uh, person, uh, industry full auto, my friends. So, that is, uh, I was talking about the speed of the interruptions done by the AI. And so we have to see very carefully, we have to study and uh, prepare our boys to go to the, uh, go to the field with all this knowledge uh, and we should be prepared uh, to uh, take challenges which is, uh, uh, which is uh, put forth by industry for thought. Basic thing I want to request to all the professors to put in the mind that the important in this era is a speed. I have talked to you about the AI is, uh, I mean, artificial intelligence is developing itself in an exponential spirit. It is developing itself. And that is why, I mean, why is simple computer, what is the difference between simple co co computer and AI, artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence develops itself. It is developing itself. That is a challenge. That is the challenge before human uh, race also. I'm warning you. Because uh, the, uh, Ray Kruswell, um, when I have seen Ray Kruswell in uh, MIT, uh, Massachusetts, uh, Boston, so he was talking about singularity. He said that a time will come when there won't be any uh, invention by the human being. Uh, that will be the last, that the robot will be the last uh, invention uh, by the human beings and rest will be taken, rest inventions will be done by the computers, AI, artificial intelligence. And so he was talking, I'm not from the school of uh, thought of uh, Dr. Ray Kruspel. I'm not, I, I don't believe in singularity because I I believe that Zobarantha uh, Dusraatsa Dukkha Bohan Tumala Dukkha Dugat Aswaita and Dusraatsa Sukh Bohan Tumala Aswaita AI will not govern you. The human race is going to govern the AI. He is over in the human, uh, all these sentiments are available, are intact with uh, us. We are going to, uh, and because that is why we will be a more creative person and we will govern this uh, to tomorrow's uh, changes also. But can you, have you, have you just imagine about the changes around us? Have you, do you know what is the speed of your email? How many people of you? Can you just anybody answer the speed of the email you're sending? Have you heard about that? Have you, heard, have, have you just thought over that? What is the speed of email? You know, we we, were, we, we have heard about the pehle pyar ki pehli chitti sajan ko leja kabutar jaja. We have heard about the pigeon who, who used to carry the uh, messages. Even we have seen in the Bollywood movies. We have heard even in the remote areas of some remote areas today also 
pigeon uh, i mean in the military uh, operations pigeon is used to carry the uh, messages uh, we know the postman postman used to take it to seven days a simple letter from one place pune to uh, aurangabad used to take seven days five days i mean if uh, a message of some old man if he is serious and if that message was to be given to a daughter staying in aurangabad from a man is staying in pune and daughter is uh, uh, is in aurangabad the the message used to come to that daughter tasa sagar dhara he used to die and then message used to come this was the time even you you must not be knowing but they used to be a khabare right people they, that that was a profession of the people in villages they used to go to place to place and give the, your uh, messages so now see the time of this is the time of even when we were a student of iit and we were uh, applying uh, for various uh, american universities the it used to cost i mean all documents you have to send we used to send to the american universities and it used to cost that time too much and used to and even by air it to that used to take it to 10 days now the speed of your email is 1.5 lakh kilometer per second i'm not talking the word per hour or per minute per second it is traveling with that tremendous speed with no money with no expenditure at your cost at no expenditure to you at their cost it, cost it is traveling with a tremendous speed the speed of 1.5 lakh kilometer per second is half the speed of light this is the time we are we are in my we are living in my friend can just imagine ki me i am talking here and you are listening in nande this is this is made available because of because of us engineers because of us technocrats this these all platforms were made ready otherwise pandemic disrupted everything everything it made everybody i mean tani je purna jagah he bandi shala purna everybody was caged a jail fact only thing different thing was that ki that jail was a different from a jail here you were having some options you were living with your own people but just because of the this platform this does because of the techno technology this online platform everything was made normal by by we engineers this is this is how we are doing we are changing this world but we are disrupting also we have to take into consideration the disruption also you know friends whenever i talk about the innovation i remember it but not sure. but i'm not sure say the people look at the things and ask people look at the things which are existing and ask why they are existing but i think about the things which are not existing and ask why they are not existing log ji gustana goshti dissat tar tya tya kare pahatat ani vicharat ki ha ka exist hota par mi tya goshtin baddal vichar karto je exist hot nahi ज्या अस्तित्वात नाही आणि विचार करतो की त्या अस्तित्वात का नाही तर दॅट इज अ स्पिरिट ऑफ इनोव्हेशन हा आत्मा आहे हा गाव आहे नाविन्यपूर्ण नाविन्यपूर्णतेचा नवीन नवीन शोधण्याचा नवीन शोध शोधांचा हा गाव आहे हा आत्मा आहे दस इज अ स्पिरिट ऑफ इनोव्हेशन की जे दिसत नाही वॉट विच आय कॅनॉट सी वाय आय कॅनॉट सी वाय दोज थिंग्स आर नॉट एक्झिस्टिंग हे सगळं तुम्ही इमॅजिन करा की ज्या लोकांना हे कसं दिसलं असेल आज जे जग हे आपण पाहतो काही वर्षांपूर्वी बिफोर फोर फाईव्ह फाईव्ह सिक्स डिकेट्स काहीच नव्हते दिस ऑल थिंग्स वेर नॉट एक्सेस्टिंग हे कसं होतं बघा कशा चेंजेस होतात एक्झॅक्टली आणि ह्यात काय गडबड होईल कोण कोणाला हाऊ दिस विल दिस ट्रिमेंड स्पीड ऑफ इनोव्हेशन अँड डिस्क्रिप्शन विल कसं तुम्हाला करेल बाहेर फेकेल तुम्हाला काहीच सांगता येणार नाही तुम्हाला गंमत सांगतो इनोव्हेशनचा स्पीड तुम्हाला सांगतो हाऊ मच इनोव्हेशन वेअर रेकग्नाइज बॉय द वर्ल्ड यु नो कॅन एनिबडी अँसर दिस थिंग इन हंड्रेड इयर्स बॅक एक शंभर वर्षांपूर्वी हंड्रेड इयर्स बॅक हाऊ मेनी इनोव्हेशन वेअर रजिस्टर्ड बाय दिस ग्लोबली दे वर रेकग्नाइज ऑर अक्नॉलेज बाय द सायंटिस्ट ऑफ दिस वर्ल्ड only four in 1920 100 years back my friend only four innovations were recognized by the global scientists and you will laugh ki kay hote the global 
कम फर्स्ट कमर्शियल रेडिओ स्टेशन इन पिट्सबर्ग पिट्सबर्ग मधलं रेडिओ स्टेशन जे आपल्याला इतकं नॉर्मल वाटतं फर्स्ट कमर्शियल रेडिओ रेडिओ स्टेशन वॉज अ इनोव्हेशन दॅट टाइम अँड इट वॉज रिकॉग्नाइज इनोव्हेशन इन पिट्सबर्ग फर्स्ट कमर्शियल रेडिओ स्टेशन रेडिओ स्टेशन जे पिट्सबर्ग मध्ये अमेरिकेला चालू सेकंड वॉज थ्री लेन्स ट्रॅफिक सिग्नल हे जे तुम्ही ट्रॅफिक सिग्नल आज बघतात ना काळा पिवळा हिरवा नाही सॉरी ग्रीन रेड अँड येलो हिरवा लाल आणि पिवळा हे जे सिग्नल्स तुम्ही बघता फ्रेंड्स हे सारे सिग्नल्स तुम्ही दॅट वॉज इनोव्हेशन दॅट थ्री लेन्स ट्रॅफिक सिग्नल वॉज इनोव्हेशन बँडेडची पट्टी बँडेड थर्ड इनोव्हेशन बँडेडची पट्टी जी आपण सखमेवर लावतो दॅट वॉज इनोव्हेशन आणि हँड हँड हेल्ड हेअर ड्रायर हाताने हेल्डची ड्राय करण्याचं हेल्ड ड्रायर दीज वेअर फोर इनोव्हेशन आज आजचा स्पीड ऑफ इनोव्हेशन एका वर्षात स्टॅनफोर्ड युनिव्हर्सिटी मध्ये देर आर नाईन हंड्रेड इनोव्हेशन रजिस्टर्ड अँड रेकग्नाइज एक्नॉलेज बाय द वर्ल्ड इन ओकस याच्यामध्ये आपल्या सुद्धा इन इव्हन इन वी नो हाऊ मेनी पेटर्न्स वी आर रजिस्टरिंग इन आर कॉलेजेस आर इन्स्टिट्यूशन्स आय मीन इव्हन स्मॉल इन्स्टिट्यूशन स्मॉल छोट्या छोट्या प्लेसेस ज्या इन्स्टिट्यूशन मधून सुद्धा पेटर्न बाहेर येत आहेत दिस इज ही कमाल आहे ही नवीन किमय आहे दिस इज हाऊ द चेंजेस आर ऑकरिंग अराउंड अस फ्रेंड्स पण त्याचे धोके कसे आहेत इफ वी डोंट अंडरस्टँड वॉट इज हॅपनिंग अराउंड अस काय होऊ शकतो तुम्हाला सांगतो कोडॅक कंपनीज हाऊ मेनी पीपल आता आय आय कॅन नॉट सी यू ऑन ऑल दिस आय मीन दिस इज अ ऑनलाईनचा एक थोडासा प्रॉब्लेम हा असतो की आय कॅन नॉट सी यू हाऊ मेनी पीपल नो अबाउट हर्ड अबाउट द कोडॅक कंपनी कोडॅक कंपनी कोडॅक वॉज वन्स अबाउट अ टाईम ब्रँड फॉर फोटोग्राफी जसं कोलगेट आहे आता तुम्हाला माहिती आहे की एखादा कामवाले बाईला जर विचारायचं ना तर ती एखाद्या दुकानात गेली तर शी विल हास्क फॉर तुमच्याकडे पतंजलीचं कोलगेट आहे का शी विल आस्क दॅट गिव्ह मी अ कोलगेट ऑफ पतंजली मीन्स शी इज आस्किंग फॉर पतंजली टूथपेस्ट बट फॉर देम टूथपेस्ट इज कोलगेट कोलगेट ऑफ पतंजली कोलगेट ऑफ एनिथिंग सो कोलगेट इज ब्रँड दॅट ब्रँड इट इज ब्रँडेड इन सच ए मॅ फॅशन सच ए मॅनर दॅट they understand that i mean for them toothpaste is colgate colgate is toothpaste and other brands are like ways kodak once more was once upon a time of brand for photography everywhere kodak's name is film you take about the cameras film everything kodak camera kodak films what is the history kodak as kai as what is that's a capital market capital capital of the 1996 codex so market capital was 2 lakh crore rupees kindly listen very carefully how kasa he jag chaltam 2 lakh crore was a market capital of codex company in 9 in 1996 my friends 1996 made 2 टू लॅक क्रोड त्यांचं मार्केट कॅपिटल होत दे वेअर हॅव्हिंग वन लॅक अँड फोर्टी थाउजंड एम्प्लॉईज ऍट देअर डिस्पोजल त्यांच्याकडे एक दीड लाखाच्या जवळ जवळ कर्मचारी कोडॅक साठी काम करायचे हे होत जायंट इन फोटोग्राफी हे होत जायंट वर्ल्ड वाईड नोन एज अ कोडॅक कंपनी नाव द हिस्ट्री इन टू थाउजंड ट्वेल्व्ह वॉट हॅपन्स इज no cameras are available in almost all the phones in our smartphones cameras are available everywhere even in in in, in, in cameras are available in 2000 in uh, if you purchase a phone of 2000 to banana bahadu ke cameras are right? if you go for a higher range of phones then we are talking about the pixels and all those and resolution power and all those sophisticated cameras are available in our smartphones you can imagine what happens to the code they are not recognized they never thought about this disruption they the giant hatti la vatla ki mara kon kay karu shakto 2000 made tyachakade only 12 employees ani tase to bankrupt zala kodak is bankrupt with 12 employees in 2012 ata hi the the history hai kodak is a history blackberry badal tumhala mahit asel ban blackberry was once upon a time apple sarkha tase status symbol hota mhanje if you go and purchase a मोटरसायकल ऑफ वन लॅक रुपीज तुम्हाला कोणी बघायचं नाही 
म्हणजे तुम्हाला ती तिच्याबद्दल काही चर्चा व्हायची नाही म्हणजे ती मोटरसायकल एक एवढा म्हणजे एक क्विंटल भरची मोटरसायकल जर तुम्ही इफ यू शो दॅट ह्यूज मोटरसायकल पर्चेसिंग दॅट वॉज नॉट अटॅट सिम्बॉल म्हणजे कॅड ब्लॅकबेरीचा पन्नास साठ हजाराचा दॅट टाइम फोन वॉज अ स्टॅटस सिम्बॉल जसा ऍपल आहे आपण आता प्रत्येक इव्हन ए बिग पर्सन इव्हन इंडस्ट्री टाईप ऑन ऑल्सो एक्झिबिट्स एट एस अ स्टॅटस सिम्बॉल ब्लॅकबेरी इज नो मोर ब्लॅकबेरी इज अ हिस्ट्री नोकिया इज अ हिस्ट्री नोकिया वॉज वन समोर अ टाईम नोकिया वॉज द बेस्ट ब्रँड फॉर टेलिफोन सेट्स सेलफोन सेट्स नोकिया इज अ हिस्ट्री दिखाव बेगाव बिकॉज सी डार्विनचा नियम आहे की आय मीन द स्ट्रॉंगेस्ट अँड मोस्ट इंटेलिजंट पीपल दे डोंट सर्व्हाईव्ह ते ते सर्व्हाईव्ह करतात असं नाही नाही तर मग तर डायनासोर सर्व्हाईव्ह झाला असता इट वॉज द स्ट्रॉंगेस्ट अँड द मोस्ट स्ट्रॉंगेस्ट अँड द मोस्ट इंटेलिजंट स्पेसिस ऑफ दॅट टाइम पण ते सर्व्हाईव्ह झालं नाही बिकॉज इट बिकॉज डायनासोर नॉट दे डिडंट रिस्पॉन्ड टू द चेंजेस अराउंड सर्व्हायवल कोणाचं होतं दे द पीपल हू रिस्पॉन्ड टू द चेंजेस अराउंड अस दे आर सर्व्हाईव्ह लक्षात घ्या कोडायक हिस्ट्री झालं हॅव यू हर्ड अबाउट ब्लॉक बस्टर ब्लॉक बस्टर हे नाव किती लोकांना माहिती आहे सगळ्यांना माहिती आहे ब्लॉक बस्टर म्हणजे काय वॉट वॉट कम्स टू अवर माइंड वेन आय टॉक अबाउट वेन आय दिस अटर दिस वर्ड ब्लॅक बस्टर एकदम आपल्याला मोठ मोठ्या हिरो हिरोईनचे चेहरे अमिताभ शाहरुख ऋतिक रोशन अजून आमिर खान सलमान खान ऑल दिस पीपल दीपिका माधुरी ऑल दिस we the all these people akshay uh, kumar we, all these people come to our mind when we talk about blockbuster blockbuster we matle ki tumhala atavel ekdam hindi movie but as once upon a time in our time when we were young there were no they were not they were not blockbusters the, that time movies were jubilee they were the, the, that times movie movie were jubilee movies silver jubilee golden jubilee diamond jubilee and even some movies used to be used to stay in the cinema hall for years together शोले किंवा देर वर सम मुव्हीज ते वर्षभर चालायच्या सिनेमा हॉल मध्ये पण नाव देर इज अी टॉक अबाउट ब्लॉक बस्ट ब्लॉक बस्ट म्हणजे काय की द मुव्ही विच इज कम्प्लिटिंग ऑर ऑर मेकिंग हंड्रेड क्रोर्स मार्क ऑर एक्सिडिंग हंड्रेड क्रोर्स मार्क इन अ वीक ऑर टू दे आर टर्म एज ब्लॉक बोस्टर मुव्हीज i'm not talking about this blockbuster blockbuster was a company in dallas texas formed in i think uh, it is also formed in 1996 with 80000 employees at their disposal to serve them and 50000 was 50000 crore was the market capital of that this is dish antenna we see they were and that, that this this dish antenna was introduced by those people i mean in um, all america uh, blockbuster was a big company big name all uh, they used to show different type of movies on their uh, blockbuster uh, antennas i mean this this was, this was a time but they never thought about how slowly they are disrupt- they, they were they were disrupted by the digital technology which is coming they never thought of that even uh, in uh, i think 2008 jim keys the chief executive officer of said in a in a, in a business talk that Nes- that Net- netflix was slowly coming into the market they said that Nes- netflix is not on our radar as far as no, not our res- radar as far as uh, the business competition is concerned netflix could has nahi is gantit nahi amcha asa that's a ceo ne jim keys ne matla ana hota my friends as blockbuster dababand ali a company with 50000 crore rupees market capital 80000 employees to serve them is not is now because they kalachi paulo olkhle nahi because they didn't understand what is going around how netflix how nicely how slowly netflix is coming into the market a netflix kiti ji company has kiti lokanna mahit hai it is worth 10 lakhs rupees netflix tumcha majha gharat saglyanch jawal netflix hai you must be ata ata tumhi tumchi amchi mulo cinema theaters madhe they don't go to the cinema this new generation they don't go to the cinema halls 
they don't go to the i mean they, they, they don't go and watch the uh, i mean uh, all the series hindi or marathi or english series on our telephone and television channels they watch all everything on netflix netflix is worth 10 lakh crore 10 lakh crore i am talking about the company which was just nothing in 2008 now they have disrupted the, the giant blockbuster block buster now block buster is now the bad bandha zalela some that is it is now history all these i'm giants i'm talking they are made history by the disruptive innovations so we have to think about the disruptive innovations in our life when i visited my friends when i visited america uh first time i visited uh, america uh, i remember that time uh, i think it was 2014 2000 that was the time when uh, i visited america first time so big malls i mean malls i mean i mean i have seen the netic mall it is uh, it is around some some kilometers it is so long length of that mall is some kilometers i mean uh, messi then walmart then um name target name the name name the you name and they were having their own planes for supply there were i mean their own jet planes small planes for for, for supplying uh, i mean they 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 were so huge people in this market amazon was nothing that time in i i tell you in uh, uh 1996 amazon was that time amazon was in 1996 a small book selling company online book selling company to tumcha daravar yun pustaka vikanara mulga hota a boy on your door delivering books whatever books you used to like tumhala hi pustak bhai tala online pustakani pasun amazon ne suru kela आपला बिजनेस दॅट टाइम हे एवढे मोठे जॉईंट होते वॉलमॉट अँड सी सगळ्यांची नावं बी सगळी टार्गेट अँड मॅसी काय नेटिक मॉल हे काय ती नॉन नॉन ती मॉल्स बघायला पीपल युज टू गो आय मीन विजिटर्स लाईक अस युज टू गो टू सी जस्ट मॉल्स see this gigantic malls ke how big these malls are a kilometer parent they thun they thun pasarle li malls hote ani they for everything what i said tell me what are these amazon they were kind of amazon amazon was nothing that time it, amazon was a book book selling company online tumcha darwaja var book books anun pustak anun denara ha pustak vikreta boy hota as amazon kuthe hai mitra how अमेझॉनचं तर तुम्ही जर म्हणजे अमेझॉनच्या तुम्ही बघितलं की जेफ बेसॉस जो आहे द फाउंडर ऑफ दिस मॅन द मॅन जो इतकं त्याचा व्हिजन आहे त्या माणसाला त्याने अमेझॉनला कुठे घेऊन गेलाय बिकॉज दे हॅव अँड दे हॅव दे हॅव अंडरस्टूड दॅट द पीपल नीड द थिंग्स राईट फ्रॉम देअर शूज टू वॉट एव्हर द रिक्वायरमेंट इवन तुमच्या त्या मंदिरातल्या घरातल्या मंदिराच्या वातीपर्यंत वॉट एव्हर यू आस्क देन दे विल डिलिव्हर दोज थिंग इन टाइम दे वेन दे विल नेव्हर डू एनी फ्रॉड विथ युअर मनी इफ यू डोंट लाईक एनिथिंग दे विल देअर बॉय विल कम विदाउट एनी कॉस्ट दॅट इट दे विल चेंज द थिंग्स अँड इवन इफ वी आर नॉट हॅपी विथ समथिंग दे विल अँड कंडिशन आर दे आर लाईक दॅट रिटर्न एज फार एज बाईंग दॅट पर्टिक्युलर प्रॉडक्ट दे विल रिटर्न दॅट प्रॉडक्ट ऑल्सो रिटर्न युअर मनी ऑल्सो service from service and whatever you want we're delivering the things nicely and giving best service at your doorstep amazon is now 1.5 trillion company 1.5 trillion company my friends mujhe 108 lakh koti rupaye so this is a market capital hai 108 lakh koti rupaye half the economy of apla hai would have a bharat desh as a big nation we are having we are we are we are citizens of this big nation we are economy the half of our economy is the market capital of uh, amazon canada brazil 
किंवा अजून हा इटली लाईक आय मीन आय मीन इट देर इट इज इक्वल टू द इकॉनॉमी ऑफ ब्राझील कॅनडा ऑर इटली सच अ झँड थिंग अमेझॉन बिकम दिस इज जस्ट बिकॉज ऑफ द आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजन्स अँड डिस्ट्रक्टिव इनोव्हेशन दिस इज हाऊ वी आर फेसिंग वी आर गोइंग इन दिस एरा वी आर एंटरिंग इन दिस एरा माय फ्रेंड्स एक छोटस ऑलमोस्ट बिकॉज I don't have any uh, PPT or presentation, so only I'm talking and uh, I'm not in position to uh, understand the reflexes. I don't know what I'm doing, I don't know what I'm doing, I don't know what I'm doing. 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 There is no need to uh, share that. There is no need to share that. There is no need to share that. There is no need to share that. because the industry industry revolution ali temar at the beginning of the 19th century uh 40% of america's economy was depend depending was dependent on agriculture and at the beginning of 20th century it 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 was it uh, dependency of agriculture dependency on agriculture sector of as far as uss economy was only 4% tacha artha tasa hot nahi ki american bank bankrupt jale te barbad jale asa nahi on the contrary they become the giant they world la jagat la sagya best talents la they were uh, capable of giving employment to the best talents in the world they attracted they invited best talents from the world and they kutla kutya as they are the वर्ल्ड लीडर इन इकॉनॉमी त्याचं रिझन आहे की डिस्ट्रप्शन जेव्हा येतं म्हणजे हे सगळं फोर फॉर्टी इंडस्ट्री रेव्होल्युशननी फॉर्टी पर्सेंटचा फॉर फोर पर्सेंटवर आणलं त्यांना म्हणजे त्यांचं जे एम्प्लॉय इकॉनॉमी त्यांची डिपेंडन्सी होती ती फॉर्टी पर्सेंटहून फोर पर्सेंटवर आणली पण त्याचा अर्थ ते त्या डिस्ट्रप्शननी ते बर्बाद झाले नाही उलट ते खूप आबाद झाले दे बिकम प्रॉस्परस त्याचं रिझन आहे की दे हॅव चेंज देअर प्रोफाईल लाव जे शेतात नांगरत होते ते इथे ट्रॅक्टर करणारे मशीनवर काम करणारे हात झाले त्यांनी ते स्किल डेव्हलप केले आणि आपलं प्रोफाईल चेंज करून ते वेगळे सेक्टरमध्ये माणसं तुमचं तुम्हाला प्रोफाईल चेंज करावं तुम्हाला कोणीच हरवू शकत नाही तुम्हाला कोणी बाहेर करू शकत नाही नो बडी विल थ्रो यू आउट फ्रॉम द कॉम्पिटिशन ओनली यू हॅव टू मेक युअर सेल कॉम्पिटंट बिकॉज दिस इज अ नॉलेज एर देर इज नो escape because we are in a knowledge era and you are the powerful people who can impart knowledge or give uh, the weapon of this knowledge to your students ek chote si gosht mana marathi dun sangu da sir marathi dun sangu ka gosht hai man sakal kare sir yes sir ha tar ekas marathi chi sir hindiat hindi samajhdare hai ki marathi dun bolu ka hindi dun ek gosht hai marathi marathi dun sudha chalel sir no problem तर एक छोटीशी गोष्ट आहे सर बँकॉक मध्ये कारण की गोष्ट आहे म्हणून ती मराठीतून बरी वाटेल म्हणून मी मराठीतून सांगतो मराठी हिंदी दोन्ही वापरा सर काही हरकत नाही बरं तुम्ही जी म्हणाल ती भाषा वापरतो सर काही प्रॉब्लेम नाही पण ती गोष्ट चालेल चालेल हिंदी साईड कोणाला मराठी करणार नाही असं कोणी आहे का सर नाही असं तर कोणी नाही आहे पण असू शकतात दोन तीन जण असू शकतात सर बरं मी हिंदीतून सांगतो मग एक बँकॉक के सारे सारे जो चौरा है थे उनको चौड़ा करने का तना रुंदी करना उनको चौड़ा करने का काम चल रहा होता और तब उन्होंने देखा कि एक बौद्ध की स्लीपिंग मूर्ति थी वहां पर उसको हटा सॉरी एक बौद्ध की मूर्ति थी उसको जैसे बहुत बड़ी महाकाय मूर्ति थी उसको हटाने का काम करना जरूरी था तब उन्होंने कारण की जी मूर्ति होती ती रिलिजियस मूर्ति होती त्यामुळे त्यांनी त्याला व्यवस्थितपणे विथ अ केअर इट शुड बी हँडल सो त्यांनी दे इन्व्हायटेड बोथ मॉक्स त्यांनी बौद्ध भिक्षुकून भिक्षु भिक्षूंना त्याला हलवायला सांगितलं तर ते सगळे ह्यूज केंद्रीय सगळी मातीची मूर्ती होती मातीत बनलेली मूर्ती होती व मिट्टी से बनी मूर्ती ती मिट्टी की छँड महाकाय मूर्ती ती उसको हटाने का जब काम चल रहा था तब बौद्ध भिक्षु भिक्षुओं के बौद्ध भिक्षूंच्या ह्याच्यामध्ये सुपरविजनमध्ये उनकी देखरेख में सब उसको हटा रहे थे तब उन्होंने देखा कि क्रेन की वजह से वहां से उसका मिट्टी की परते कहीं तेजा वर्ष थर हटल गए मूर्ति वर्ष हत चका शाइनिंग मेटल वॉस ब्रिलिंटली शाइनिंग मेटल वॉस सीन एक हत चका 
धातू दिसत होती त्यामुळे त्या हे काय आहे म्हणून त्या बौद्ध भिक्षकने ते मातीचा थर हे माती नाही आज काहीतरी वेगळं आहे म्हणून ते हटवायला सांगितला आणि तुम्हाला सांगतो मित्रो ते ते संपूर्ण सोन्याची शेकडो क्विंटल सोन्याची ती मूर्ती होती महागाय सोन्याची ज्याला बँकॉक मध्ये लोक त्या बौद्ध मूर्तीला त्या गोल्डन बौद्धाला पाहायला जातात ती तीस मूर्तीबद्दल मी बोलतोय ती सातशे वर्ष वर्ष ते बा बाहेरचे लुटारू त्यावेळी यायचे आणि ते सगळं ब्रह्मदेशाकडून येणारे लुटारू ते सब उसको त्याला त्या तिथल्या त्या लोकांना लुटून घेऊन जायचे तर त्या मूर्तीला धक्का लागू नये म्हणून त्याला विशिष्ट पद्धतीच्या मातीने त्याने झाकून ठेवलं होतं त्याच्यावर सातशे वर्ष भीतीपोटी सोऱ्याची माती झाली होती मैं इतना ही कहना चाहता हूं चाहता हूं मेरे दोस्तों की डर भय ये ऐसी चीज है कि 700 साल तक वो वो मिट्टी वो सोना वो मिट्टी बन के रह गया सिर्फ भाई की मारे मेरा कहना इतना ही है कि डर से कुछ नहीं होता भय से आगे सब कुछ होता है इसलिए मैं मेरे इसको कहना इसको मेरे सेशन को खत्म करने के लिए एक छोटा सा मेरे आपके सामने शेर पेश करता हूं एक छोटा सा शेर तुम्हाला सादर करतोय आय एम प्रेझेंटिंग ए व्हेरी फ्यू लाईन्स माय फ्रेंड्स उर्दू लाईन्स अँड बार बार गिरकर भी मुकम्मल खडा हूं मॅ बार बार गिरकर भी मुकम्मल खडा हूं मॅ ऍ जिंदगी देख तुस्से कितना बडा थँक्यू व्हेरी मच अँड आय एम ओपन फॉर युअर क्वेश्चन फ्रेंड्स एनी क्वेश्चन प्लीज any questions umesh sir sir one i am going to tell nahi tumcha tumhi karan sir tumcha tumhi kara yes professor umesh urai yourself umesh sir kaitri vicharte bahut hai sir bola unmute kar sir sir thank you very much sir gaur sir it was very nice and informative session फक्त मला एक म्हणजे बिंग अ टेक्नोक्रॅट ऑर द इंजिनिअरिंग टीचर आय ऑल्सो हॅव सम अँगल ऑफ स्पिरिच्युअलिटी सो जस्ट वाय यू आर डिलिव्हरिंग युअर लेक्चर सो यू से दॅट की इन फ्युचर ऑल द आर एन डी वर्क विल बी डन बाय द रोबोट्स अँड देअर फॉर देअर विल बी नो इंटरफिअर ऑफ ह्युमन फॉर द आर एन डी पर्पज सो माय लिटल क्युरी ऑर द क्वेश्चन इज दॅट Uh, recently we face a very big uh, pandemic uh, which was uh, near about a, a threat to the human race and uh, that's why when they, the such type of a big uh, situation uh, came in the world all of the people or the all of the human beings of the world started for finding out the solution uh, to save the human race uh, if suppose in future as per your uh, prediction all the r&d work is taken by the human uh, sorry robots well uh, this type of the emotions or things will be uh, happen and second question yesterday we had a lecture uh, from one professor of pi city he said that uh, now uh, after machine learning uh, they will go for uh, deep learning also and in deep learning they will also teach the emotions and something like that to the robots so uh, is it not a threat to the human race sir uh, my simple question no uh umesh ji may uh, wanna I, i am very humbly i want to just correct you i have not said that i am not a believer in a theory of singular said that when i went to mit the great futurist you might have heard or you might not have read kurzweil is a great futurist great person in the books at to be sir singularity wagera ji pustak vasli to far as ani teni aaj je hote hai tyacha badal teni khup predictions kele hote so he is he is saying ki a time will came it inventions everything will be as a cook inventions a robot carry karta but because it is developing in an exponential speed apan jar bagat asal ki stock market cha je apan whatever we see in uh, in tv television je stock market bagta ta he possible is nahi hai human la ki itko prachand jagah cha market cha few second by fraction of second madhe kay kuthe challe he sagla tumhala karun te sakta he sagla tumhala robots by artificial intelligence is doing all these things so मी नेहमी हा तुमच्यासारखा बिलिव्हर आहे म्हणजे तुम्ही हात की नाही माहित नाही मी आय एम आय एम आय हॅव फेथ इन सुपर नॅशनल पॉवर त्याला मी गॉड म्हणू अजून कोणी काय म्हणेल 
तुम्ही कोणी काही म्हणा किंवा तुम्ही त्याला नेचर म्हणा किंवा त्याला सुपर पॉवर म्हणा काही म्हणा आय एम आय बिलीव्ह आणि मी नेहमी असं म्हणतो की तुम्ही जोपर्यंत दुसऱ्यांचं दुःख पाहून तुमच्या डोळ्यात हसू येतात आणि दुसऱ्यांचं सुख पाहून तुमच्या डोळ्यात तुमच्या घरावर हसू येत सर स्वतःच नाही लक्षात घ्या मी काय म्हणतो दुसऱ्यांच्या दुःखात मॅक्स मोस्टली दुसऱ्यांचं कोणाचं तरी दुःख झालं तर त्याला आनंद होतो असे खूप लोक असतात दुसऱ्याला आनंद झाला की त्याला तो कुठे कुठेतरी कुडतो तर चहा त्याला गोड वाटत नाही असेही लोक असतात मला तसं नाही म्हणायचं पण मी काय म्हणतो केअरफुल आहे का फार इम्पॉर्टंट आहे दुसऱ्यांच्या दुःखात तुमच्या डोळ्यात हसू येतात आणि दुसऱ्यांच्या सुखा सुखात तुमच्या गालावर हसू येतं तोपर्यंत जगातला कुठलाही रोबो तुम्हाला सुपर सुपरसिट करू शकत नाही तुमच्या पुढे जाऊ शकत नाही यू विल गव्हर्न तुमच्या इमोशन्स जे आहेत ती तुमची क्रिएटिव्हिटी आहे दॅट विल मेक यू रूल दिस वर्ल्ड नो रोबो विल हे होणार नाही रोबोला तुम्ही कितीही सर तुम्ही कितीही संवेदना शिकवल्या तरी जे आपण आई पोटातून गर्भातून शिकून आलेलो असतो त्या संवेदना आपण त्या मशीनला कधीच येणार नाही म्हणजे तुम्हाला सांगतो की मी गमतीने सांगतो ऑल प्रोफेसर्स आर देअर की तुम्ही मला लोक सांगतात की सर आपण खूप जिवंत कसे होते कसं समजा आपण हळूहळू ओल्ड कसे मला आणि आय एम सिक्स्टी सेव्हन इयर्स ओल्ड माझ्या सगळे कलिग कॉलेजमध्ये जे मुलं होती मी वेन आय वॉज प्रिन्सिपल तुम्ही जर कुठल्याही माझ्या यांना विचारलं तर ते वेन ऑल यंग थर्टी थर्टी टू अशी सगळी होती ती युस्ट लव्ह मी ते त्याचं कारण आहे की ते नेहमी मला म्हणायचं सर तुम्ही इतकं नवीन कसा विचार करता त्याचं कारण असं आहे सर की जोपर्यंत तुम्ही तुम्ही ओल्ड व्हायला सुरुवात होतं कसं कळायला पाहिजे तुम्हाला की जेव्हा तुम्ही तुमच्या तुमचा जो पार्टनर असतो त्याच्या चेहऱ्या त्याचं ते हसणं पहिलं त्याच्या त्याच्याकडे आपण पाहू पाहिलेलं किंवा त्याचं पहिलं लाजणं हे विसरतो तेव्हा आपलं एजिंग सुरू होऊन गेलं असतं ते आपल्याला जोपर्यंत आठवतो ना सर तोपर्यंत आपलं एजिंग चालू होत नाही तोपर्यंत आपण चिरतरून मनात असतो आणि तो हे सगळं आपण ठेवलं तर वी विल डेफिनेटली नो मशीन आपल्या इमोशन्स मशीन्स घेऊ शकत नाही उमेश सर तुम्ही फार उत्तम व्हेरी नाईस क्वेश्चन आणि मला फार आवडलं की तुमच्याशी इंटरॅक्ट करायला आपलं आपली बाजू घे क्रुसवेल सरांना मी खूप मोठा माणूस आहे मला माझं भाग्य की मला जस्ट बिकॉज माझे एक मित्र घेतले तिथे ते हेड ऑफ डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ मेकॅनिकल इंजिनिअरिंगचे ते ही इन्व्हायटेड मी द्या इन दर एम आय टी मॅसुचे मॅसुचेसेसचं म्हणतोय बॉस्टनचं सो माय डॉक्टर वॉज स्टेईंग देअर प्रिव्हियसली तर त्यांनी मला बोलावलं तिथे आणि त्यांची भेट झाली तर तो एवढा मोठा माणूस मला भेटला तर त्यांचं असं थिंकिंग आहे की मशीन हळूहळू तुमच्या आणि आपल्याला ते करतात पण त्याही मशीनला आपण गव्हर्न कसं करू शकतो त्यां ते आपण शिकत जायचं तर आपण त्या आपल्या कंट्रोलमध्ये राहते उमेश सर थँक्यू उमेश सर आय थिंक तुम्हाला सर उमेश सर थँक्यू वेरी मच सर थँक्यू सर थँक्यू सर आपलं आजचं आभार प्रदर्शन आमचे माझे सहकारी श्री युष्केवार सर करतील त्यापूर्वी मी एक दोन मिनिट सांगू इच्छितो पुन्हा आजचं या अटेंडन्स चांगलं अटेंडन्स आहे तरी या हे अटेंडन्स आपण सगळ्यांनी कायम ठेवावं ही तर एक विनंती आहेच आणि त्याचबरोबर आपण प्रत्येका सेशन मध्ये आम्ही जो अटेंडन्स लिंक टाकतो ते आम्हाला अटेंडन्स आय एस टीला सादर करायचं आहे त्याचप्रकारे ऍट द एंड ऑफ द डे फक्त सहा एम सी क्यूज ची आम्ही एक इव्हॅल्युएशन टेस्ट आहे सोपी टेस्ट आहे तर ती सुद्धा आपण सगळ्यांनी सोडवणं आवश्यक आहे कारण हा सगळा रेकॉर्ड आम्हाला आय एस टी ला जमा करायचा आहे तर कृपया सगळ्यांनी सहकार्य करावं आणि अजून एक हॅन्ड रेज केलेला आहे कोणीतरी प्लीज बोला हा उमेश सर झालंय ना आपलं आय थिंक उमेश सर हॅज already asked the question so uh, may i request my colleague uh, shri ushkewar sir to uh, uh, give a vote of thanks so thank Ushkewar. you very much sir uh, i am very privileged to be here to offer the vote of thanks for today's morning session uh, professor deepak singh gaur sir Yes, yeah. He has enlightened the change in the technology and what are the effects on the human beings. He rightly focused so many things. So here, unless otherwise, 
we adopt the technology the technology will replace you so that is the one thing the another thing that is he writes some of the columns in the newspapers so that is very important particularly the technological changes they must be communicated to the society through such things only so that is a great work god uh, sir is uh, offering his services to the society i think that is a uh, very much essential because a common people uh, when he adopts such things then it will be a great for the progress of our nation also and one thing uh, i have noted during his uh, say interaction is that he believes that even though the technology can oversee the human being but you should not cross the limit that first of all you have to understand that you are the human and we should use the technology to that extent where do the humanity can be maintained that is that is what the message uh, sir rightly uh, passed for us so uh, i also thank on this occasion professor sakarkare sir to give an opportunity to listen such a respected and renowned personality in this uh, uh, industry 4.0 or see these technological changes closely observed by gorsa by not only in india but he visited so many countries also so he has shared uh, his thoughts in a very lucid simple and friendly language for all of us definitely sir uh, this will really help us this will uh, spark us the in while teaching learning process also the teacher will adopt the technology uh, by your uh, valuable words uh, will be the guiding for all of us okay thank you very much sir on behalf of government polytechnic nanded and the organizing committee thank you sir thank you sir thank you very much okay thanks once once again uh, professor gaur Uh, i am indeed uh, very grateful to you and hope our uh, uh, association will continue in future also and uh, yeah thank you so, sir kare sir and thank you principal sir uh, yeah. thank yeah, you very much everybody is our principal dr uh, garje sir is our principal and garje sir thank you yeah yeah so uh, uh, with your kind permission uh, Uh, yes, sir. I declare that uh, today's session is over. Thanks once Thank again. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Bye.